welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zelot, and we are here today doing the Iron Man Season 7 competition. And we, as you can see today, I have this big slab of concrete that I have laid out. Here, let me spawn my drone, I'll show you. So I've laid out this big slab of concrete on this island in the lake here, and I thought that this would be a good spot to <clears throat> create a base, or a, at least a big freaking spawning pad. <laughs> so, today, oh, is that some dirt there? What's, yep, that's dirt. Can't have dirt, can't have dirt. Okay. Um, can't have butterflies, can't have butterflies. Oh, I can't target it. Okay. I guess that was a dragonfly. That's okay. It's a dragonfly. I'll, I'll let those go. Um, okay. So, today... Yeah, that's fine. I don't need to modify that. We are going to create a capital vessel. And... I was thinking of actually doing it from scratch, uh, but I already had the the basic starter one that I, it's basically a starter base that I start with now and, and uh, turn it into a full-blown capital vessel. And you'll see what I mean. I'm gonna spawn it in right here. If anyone's followed any of my other series, uh, since Alpha 8 uh, Experimental <clears throat> it's the base that I use and yeah it's not really a base it's a capital vessel so let's do this uh, it's ready to go we're going to spawn in my CB Camo Shack and where do we want this to sit so I don't mind if it's a little bit crooked on the pad what I want is to be fairly centered though that's pretty good there. So let's make sure it doesn't fall too far. And let's do that. That looks good. Whoa. Jumping around. <laughs> As you can see, it's not a base. It's a vehicle, so it could bounce if it wants. Um, so, also because it's a vehicle, it's not subject to structural integrity. Um, what we're going to do first is we're going to actually dismantle this thing. <laughs> I know it sounds ridiculous and crazy, but yeah, we're going to dismantle it. Yeah, no, it is quite a bit crooked, isn't it? Okay. Okay, well, oh well, that's just life. It's going to go off on an angle, that's all. That's all. So, let's get down to it we're just gonna actually start nuking this thing because it's not actually how I want it so let's grab the stuff off here for now before it actually before we fill it up I do want the gear it's just a, it's not where I want it so I'm just gonna remove it all <laughs> I got, oh, I don't have the space. Okay. So we'll use the. So I've got a bunch of stuff in here. Yeah. My CV boxes. Now, the reason why I didn't bother with a. A starter, a CV starters, because well, for starters, I didn't actually have a um, constructor that's capable of that. And I don't really need it right off the bat. I just need a CV block down, really. That's all I need. <clears throat> okay, so let's remove this space 
and then we've got a couple of yeah we've got space for the blocks here so we're just going to take all this and you can see what i mean by structural integrity i'll show you so structural integrity is on yet that can float because this is a vehicle it's not subject to structural integrity okay so i'm just taking this down we have a whole bunch of blocks that uh, we're gonna lay down so first thing i like to do is make a hanger and i don't actually have a hanger um, door unfortunately so we're gonna start with just a floor <clears throat> let me just get all this down and then we'll make the garden area and then extend past that into the construction room and the cockpit Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to have enough blocks to do all that today. I, I, I hope so. I'm hoping we can... I'm not going to probably cover the, the hangar bay today. I'll probably just get the, the floor of it down. Because uh, I want to get the... I want to get the grow up going for sure. So that's... That has to get all covered. I have to have enough blocks for that. I've got a fair amount of hardened steel blocks, but I've, I think I've only I only have a couple hundred of the regular steel. I mean, obviously I can make more, but I also have the three pieces of the Titan that I can still multi-tool down quite a bit. Like I barely touch them. I barely touch them. So, and I didn't feel like sitting there for a week multi-tooling the things with a tier one multi-tool. So I want to get an advanced constructor going. Are we on space? Yeah, I can pick that up. Good. Okay, so let's fill this back in. I don't need the concrete blocks on me, but that's okay. Okay. We will move the core eventually. But, so the, the hangar bay door, it's going to go... Actually, I just want to leave. Come on, I just, just one, please, one, one. It's not going to let me do one. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I just wanted to do one. <sighs> we'll retrieve that. The reason I want that there is because that is the center. That is going to be my center line, regardless of anything. It's just a nice visual center line. Okay, so, hmm. If we have a 13 by seven door, that means we need six on either side, right? So subtract a center block and six on either side makes 13. So let's do out from the center block We've got, see how it actually tried to connect to the base there? So that's good that the CV is off by a bit so that it, uh, I can totally tell when I'm connected to the base and or the CV. So that's three, four, five, and six. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, what I should do is probably put a symmetry plane on here so I'm not duplicating what I'm doing. So let's do that. So to get your symmetry up, you just aim at your vehicle or building. <coughs> and do uh, symmetry plane and then for this one I'm going to do front to back right down the middle so I want to do a YZ and then I'm going to click where I want it in the middle of this block is that right let's 
Is that right? No, I missed it. So I, I want the middle. Come on, right there. There we go. Okay. So now whenever I put a block down, it's going to duplicate it on the other side. So if I go like this, you can see it's adding it to the other side. So if I leave a full strip, it does a full strip to the other side. So we can, we can technically build this much quicker, even doing single blocks, doing block by block. But I don't want to do that. What I want to do is I want to grab all the blocks that I have here. <clears throat> and we've got 120 steel. Here, let's swap that out. Put that there. I want the hardened steel. Let's just put that in there for now. Um, the armored window. Do I need the armored window? Those are just window blocks. Let's put some of this stuff away. Oh my goodness. And we'll just throw that there for now. Okay. Okay, so let's keep putting these blocks down. Now, how so that's the width, that's the width, and then we're going to have walls coming up, like so. <clears throat> so that'll be one, two, three, four, five, six, plus one, so that'll be 13, that'll be our uh, hangar bay door. Okay. Okay, um, well... If that's the real width there, so let's bring that forward. Um, how deep do we want it to go, right? So how big do we want our hangar bay? It doesn't have to go really too crazy. Let's go a little a smidge deeper. What do you think? that deep yeah that'll be big enough for now I could extend it out back more if that's gonna work better later on but for now we'll just do this and you can see how fast it fills in just by doing small strips right when you got the symmetry plane so that's nice okay so we've got the Hangar bay floor down. Uh, the next thing I like to do is actually put up an elevator. So, right, let's get elevator, elevator and and door blocks. <clears throat> so we got. We're gonna need some lights. Door. gonna put the armor locker and the O2 station in pretty quick. Large constructor we'll just throw up here for now. And ventilator there for now. Okay. Oh, don't really have space for much else. Where is my elevator blocks? They must be over here. There's a few of them. There we go. I thought I had more than that. Should I use them for the... You know what? I used them in the factory. I used them in the factory. That's fine. Okay, so what we want is here. Let's put these down here. Uh, might as well flip that to there. I'm not going to need my band aids. So. We're going to want to go up right there. That means this is going to be do 
like this. Okay. So the bottom section, so this is going to come out like this. And then again, like this. Yeah, I've ran out of steel blocks, so we're just going to use hardened steel now. Um, and then that's going to go up one. That's going to go up one. So we're going to... Where is it? You know what? It, it will anyway. Yeah, let's just, let's just go like this. That's fine. Let's get this down. <clears throat> well, that's not connecting. Or is it? Yeah, that's not on the right block. That's not on the right block. So those I did not connect, connect correctly. See that? So now I got to get rid of those. Got to be careful. I got to be more careful. That really sucks. Wasting my charges. And these take forever to pick up. At least I caught it before I kept building. That's the only drawback about building on uh, a base that can also you can put the same material down on. Okay, that. Let's see. Nope, that's the base. Yep, see, that's totally off. Eh. Okay, so I know what to. I know where it starts now. I should have saw that. That was a bad place. Okay. <laughs> well, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to build this out. Um, so I'm going to multi to this out and then build the floor out and get the walls up. And I'll come back when I'm on to the next section here. So I'll be right back. Okay, we are back, and I'll show you what we've done so far here. Uh, I'm pretty much out of blocks, so <clears throat> this is as done as we're going to get. Uh, I'm going to put in more gear at this point, but we have a sealed garden. Yay! So it's going to have... Oh, God, now I don't... Well, let's see what we got here. We've got three, six, nine times 6 is 54 times that by 2 so it'll have 108 grow plots when it's done uh, not bad not bad uh, not bad for a CV anyway right and then I've started on the construction room but I don't have enough blocks to finish it but it's a good start it'll get me enough space to start throwing some gear in here too so <clears throat> <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I've also got the core moved. You can see I ran out of blocks up here. I couldn't get the symmetry to to fill it all in. A anyway, um, in behind here is the core. So I've moved it up in here with double thickness uh, hardened steel surrounding it. And then eventually there'll be more too. So this is just going to be the inner core. I don't know if I'm going to actually be able to, I probably won't have time to do an outer core anyway. So we're just going to make this look as pretty as possible. And I'm not going to spend a whole bunch of time. It's going to be function and not finesse. Okay. So it's going to be function. <coughs> um, okay. So the core has been moved and yeah. What we're going to do now is we're going to put some more gear in now. So let's get the HV and we'll just bring it up onto the uh, onto the, the CV hanger um, floor. Here, let's turn my jetpack and get in. 
Okay, turn our engines on. And we will get up out of the water here. Okay. And we'll just park really close here. That's good. <coughs> this is fine. just turn the engines back off again so this thing has a fridge that we're utilizing right now and the constructor so we don't want to completely turn it off yet um, with the constructor is actually doing nothing let's throw some of this stuff in there and we do need more plant grow lights can I actually do that in here no Nope. Okay. So let's get some of this gear in now. We're going to need... We've got fuel. Okay. So let's grab something to eat really quick from the fridge. Do a couple grilled steaks. That sounds good. You can see I got a bunch of fire moss and confetti moss scrapings because I figured out who to kill to loot those off of on the starter planet. And... <clears throat> that's going to go far a long way to getting my med packs um, so awesome I, I'm going to have to go swimming for all the um, the other stuff oh let's get all the blocks derp a derp we need the stuff we need the stuff grab those I'm going to do a T2 I don't think we need the T2 but I don't think we have any other generators. Do we have any other generators? No. Grab that. We're not going to worry about the... Grab the more light blocks. We won't worry about the, the engines and stuff yet. Although this can go upstairs. <coughs> um, grab those. We'll grab those. We're going to need those. Put that down here. We'll grab that right now because we need it. And we're going to need. Here, let's. Just regular window blocks. Okay. Okay, so. Let's get this gear in. Actually, for starters, I think out here, we can start with um, one of these oxygen generators our oxygen dispensers so I'm gonna put that right here and we'll put a armor locker right beside it <coughs> over on this side okay and then I'll be putting some stuff out here too for now I think I might have to just because I don't have the th uh, we'll see you know what that's fine we'll just do this we'll do this put this out here and what about the thermal parasite endoparasite alien parasite radiation poisoning radiation burn radiation sickness fever attack Broken leg, closed fracture, open fracture, mutilation, open wound, frostbite, dermal burn, necrosis, infected wound, sepsis, indigestion, food poisoning, poisonous bite, intoxication, piece organ. Po Let's do this one. Let's do this one. This one sounds like it's going to be useful for right now. Right, we'll just turn this around. There, we'll do that one. Okay, and we can do cargo boxes out here <coughs> so you notice I've turned the um, um, the telemetry off because it doesn't work when placing gear very well 
One, two, three. Stop it. Four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, five. Okay, good enough. <coughs> okay. Okay, that gives us a lot of storage now. So we've got some basic necessities we come flying in we're out of auction we can do that where we need healing we can do that um, we've got you know any one of those things we can do that we'll probably put another uh, of the other type up there uh, and then another one up there probably We'll look into it. We're going to have a full medical station too, I think. So let's, where should we do the light? Let's do a light up here. Do a light. Right there. Okay, so let's head in. Let's head in. And we can do the ventilator. We'll do the ventilator above the door. That's fine. <clears throat> so the ventilator we can just stick in here. Um, not that we actually need one on the planet, but if we take this thing to the moon, we'll need it. So, Okay, let's head up here. And... get some gear up here in so oh did I not grab that stuff Ugh. horrible grab it I can grab it that's okay that's okay that's the handy thing about the drone right now until they take this ability away from us we can use it to grab stuff <laughs> from other places uh, I'll need that ventilator too uh, let's put that away for now. So the tech equipment does not do the medical stuff anymore. That's just tech equipment blocks. Okay, so we've got generators, fuel tanks. Do I not have, oh, I got one oxygen tank, two. Okay, so not a lot of oxygen tanks. We're gonna have to make more of those. That's fine. That's fine. So we've got O2 there. We're going to need O2 in here. Oops. No. <laughs> you can see how twitchy working with the drone can be because the drone is, it kind of drifts really easy and Whatever, it's 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 okay. It's faster than building by foot anyway. So, okay, so we've got a ventilator in here. We can start putting in our constructors. So let's spin this. Do that. Get another one in beside it. Come on. Come on, right there, and then I'll, I'll build more tech equipment and it's going to go there. So we'll put a light, let's get a light here, put uh, one of those ones on the ceiling there. Okay, and we're going to need lights in here, so let's do one here there and then we're gonna need our grow lights do we have any we have three okay that'll get us started so one one two three oh I'm derping <laughs> I'm 
like, wait, that doesn't look like a grow light, because that's not. That's not. Okay, let's try this again. <clears throat> so, one over and one in, and then two over from that. One, two, and oops, right there. Okay. And then we've got one left. Okay, we'll have to build more. We'll build more. We'll build more. Okay, so we've got some lights in. We've got the ventilators in. Let's get stuff upstairs. So, this crazy T2 generator. <laughs> You know what? That's just as good a place as any, really. Sadly. But I'm not going to. I'm going to spin it. I'm going to tuck that right in. Get it right in there. Or I could even spin it more. One more. But, nope, that's too big. Okay, so let's... No, let's, let's do this. That's fine. Right there. Okay. Well, we don't technically need another generator. That's more than we're going to need for the entire ship. But I'm going to place one, a little one anyway. Just because. Back up. Back up to get us out of a tight spot if somebody blows up our generator. <laughs> okay, so let's get these fuel cells in here. We'll get uh, two there and then you know what right now I'm not gonna need I'm not gonna need this generator it's just gonna eat up a bunch of fuel so I'm not gonna use it yet. I will, but it's not going to be necessary. So let's let's not do that yet. I'm just going to put this here. Um, you know what? We can put the oxygen up here too, and these smaller tanks. I had a smaller oxygen tank too. Do that and then didn't we? We had a smaller oxygen tank. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I should probably put the sentry guns up there too eventually, just in case for wandering drones. Okay, so we can put this right here put this up there too. Okay, so that gives us generator and fuel tanks, oxygen tanks for now. That'll get us up and running. So let's fuel this thing up. And, oh yeah, we've got those and those to put downstairs. We don't need to worry about that. Put this stuff in later. Okay, so let's, let's head downstairs. We can fuel that up from, up, from downstairs. <coughs> So we want to put these down. I like put them, putting them to either side of the door. And then I like putting a large fridge to either side on top. And that gives us lots of storage, cold storage, because the two, um, the 
two food processors also act as fridges on the input and their input is quite large so it's actually nice okay so this O2 is gonna go over there we can do it on that side that's fine and then we'll have nothing over here yet that's fine that's fine okay so now what we can do is we can start hang on let's let's group stuff let's group stuff right now you know what let's put some stuff away right now actually Okay, actually what we can do is we can transfer. Let's group everything here. Oh yeah, yeah, thrusters, RCS, and cockpit are missing. I know, I know, I know. But what we've got is, let's name this builder. I'll have more, oops, oh, caps lock. Get away, caps lock. And I don't know, the other one will be O2 fuel for now. O2 fuel. Okay. <clears throat> so, what I want to do is I want to transfer basically all this stuff. get it all into the builder for now. Let's get this stuff back down here. Okay. Uh, a bunch of this stuff is not going in the constructor. It'll be going in the food processors. Actually, you know what? Yeah, let's just grab the rest of it now. I've got the space, might as well. All that stuff goes in there. And then we're going to go put some stuff in here. Nice. Okay, and you know what? Let's fuel this up. Let's fuel this up. Let's see if... Almost, that took quite a bit. That was good. Let's see. There, we'll use these. Nice, there we go. 100% full. Um, let's... Oh, it's turned on. It's turned on. It says the lights are on. Yep, lights are on. There we go. It's powered up. All right. So we should have... We should have 22 degrees in here. Yep. There we go. So we can start growing stuff now. I got to get the... Um, let's get the constructor going on. Which one's my builder? That's not it. So that one... So, we need more lights. OK. 
Okay. And what else do we need? Um, oh, so much more stuff we can make now. Woo! I gotta go golem hunting. I gotta go golem hunting to make those flux coils. It's gonna be... I, I, I'm pretty close by the look of it. <coughs> That's okay. That's okay. So we need a. We'll just do a small ammo box for now. We need another elevator block. Um, and what does it take for the growth steel growth blocks again? Oh, we can't build them in here. We gotta upgrade this. Okay. So what do we need to upgrade? Flux coils. So a whole bunch of. Neo and Sath. Hmm. Well, that's kind of disappointing. That's kind of disappointing. What we're going to do is we'll get the... Uh, we'll get the grow up going. Um, well, that's cooking. Well, that's cooking. Let's go get the stuff for the grow up. And transfer all the food too. So let's do that really quick and then we can shut this off. There we go. Don't waste its fuel anymore. Don't need to. Okay, so let's have this one, our main growing one. So it's going to need like the eggs and cheese and butter and all that stuff. Just throw that in there for now. The other one's going to be... Oh yeah, so let's grab that. The other one's going to be our medical. So that, that's going to be our food. This is going to be our medical. Okay. Okay. So we can make, the great thing about this is that I don't need to transfer anything now. I can just make stuff, but we do need stone dust and purify water. Okay. Okay. Well, I've got the water generator going over here. Yep. doing? How are all these doing? This guy is done. We'll grab that. And this guy is pretty much done, so we'll grab that. Good. Good, we're getting there. We're getting there. And... Is the sun coming up or going down? It's hard to tell. I can't... I think it's coming up. Yeah, we spent the whole night building this thing. The whole day and night. Uh, oh, right. We can grab all the stuff out of here now. Or at least some of it. get that we'll get that stuff in here so let's do this uh, builder and so we need stone to oh right we need stone dust the stone dust. There, we'll grab half of that. That's fine. So a lot of people don't realize, so what I'm going to show you here is I'm just going to put the, the crushed stone in and the water jugs in. 
it's actually capable of crushing the stone and making purify water for its stuff. So. See how it says it needs spoiled few purify water five and stone dust? But you don't actually see any of that on the templates, right? You don't you don't actually see it on the templates. But when I but it shows that I can do it. Well how is that? I don't have spoiled purified water, I don't have stone dust. Those are things that are built intrinsically into it. As templates you don't need to actually activate the template you can't actually do that individually either but it can on its own to create this so watch when I when I do the purified water stone dust four. so purified water of five I don't know how much water jugs that consumes let's see I have 51 and stone dust of four and you can see it consumed five stone dust it consumed one water jug and it's creating purify water even though that it doesn't have it as a template or at least that I could not find um, and it also created stone dust which I couldn't find you used to see it as a template in here so I think people are confused now thinking that it can't do that on its own but it still can it still absolutely can you could just put in the raw material and it will refine it to be able to make what it needs. So let's go ahead and make um, make the rest of that. Put that in there. Um, put that in there. Nope, that's the wrong one. And we need to get the plants going too. So that's going to create a cost a bunch of cobalt to create the rest of these grow plots too and I don't have the constructor yet to do that um, so what is it going to take to create 10 flux coils 20 sathium and 50 neo. Yeah, I'm not too far off. I'm not too far off. I think we'll be able to pull this off. Yeah. The other option I can do is I could spawn it in as a as a constructor all on its own, as a CV, just a um, just a core with the constructor. <laughs> I can do that. I actually have it as a plan, I'm pretty sure. Let's see. CV Advanced Constructor. That's all it is. It's just the Advanced Constructor and a core. So, 50 Neo, 20 Sathium, 60 Cobalt. Oh, I didn't realize it was that expensive on Cobalt. Holy crap. Okay. Okay, that might be the limiting factor now. Oh, we have the cobalt. Oh yeah, we've got the cobalt. Okay, so... It'll be the Neo and Sack. Well, the Neo in particular. Well... Okay. Uh, well, I'm gonna finish getting these lights up and get what we can growing, really. I mean... And then I guess I gotta go hunt golems. That's a drag, but I don't see another way to get the gear that I'm gonna need. Oh man, did I screw that up? Yeah, I totally did. Okay, let's try this again. <clears throat> so I go one, two, and then on the third one, boom. One, two, third one, boom. One, two, third one, boom. There. Let's get these over here. 
Okay, so I need one, two, three, four more. One, two, th one, two, three more. Three more. Okay. Then I can service all those plots that I have. Okay, so I've got two. I need one more. Get that. <coughs> and I can put that up. Let's get this installed. to find, is it? Which cargo box did I put all my crap in? Oh, it's right there. Well, uh, we'll put that back there. That. Yeah, I didn't put anything anywhere else. Okay. That's okay. It must be still in the CV. Or in the uh, HV. I'll keep transferring stuff over. Let's get these lights up. have grow light coverage okay um, uh, I guess we need something to eat let's make some steaks those two. Okay. Okay. We're pretty happening now. Just plop this door down. Like that. That's good enough. That's good enough, so that seals that in. To nothing yet, because this isn't sealed, but it will. <clears throat> okay. Okay, we're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good here. I think we got a lot accomplished today. I think we got a lot accomplished today. So, let's get our grow op going here. We'll use every vegetable we can, really. You know, let's um, put this stuff over here. Okay, so we need, let's do the grain first. Because I wouldn't mind making a T2 drill pretty quick. So let's start by, I'm gonna have Three rows of grain at least, I'm thinking. Okay. Um, what else? We're going to need a bunch of vegetables. So we'll get these vegetables going. And then healing herbs, plant fiber, pear things of fruit, and aloe. Okay, so let's get the vegetables. So.
do the we don't want to do the rest of this vegetables we actually want spice I want to make some spice I need spice do we have spice we do can we make spice I need one more Okay, so we gotta go get spice and we gotta go get golems. Well, I'm gonna do that off camera. I'm gonna finish planting this stuff. I need a ton of spice, really. Spice is what I need to make all the canned goods with, so. Um, we'll get vegetables going anyway. Might as well. I don't really care if it's a mix and match. Okay, so we got some vegetables going now. And over on this side, we'll get some aloe vera, some healing stuff, some fruits. So lots of healing stuff. Okay, and then fruit. I'm not too concerned about the fiber. The fiber we can make from trees anyway, so. Okay, there we go. We've got the start of our garden. Excellent. Excellent, that was our goal for today. So we did it, goal accomplished. Okay, I'm gonna throw these up on the roof somewhere and then uh, put the ammo box in, uh, fill it with some ammo, and then I'm gonna go hunt golems and um, um, what the hell was the other thing too, right? Uh, the spice. I gotta go pick spice and hunt golems. So that's my goal right now. So I'm gonna take the HV out and, uh, do that. Um, hmm. I should probably make some ammo for it really quick though. And what do I need for a T2 drill? I can do that right now, but I don't have plastic, do I? I don't have any plastic? None. Huh. Okay, well I will have plastic pretty soon, as soon as that stuff grows, so that's not too bad. So I can make, I'll be able to make a couple of T2 drills, and oh, I can make the EVA boost right now. Nano gold ingot. Oh yeah, look at that. You know what? I think I'm going to make that right now while I can so I don't screw up and not make it. Uh, HV minigun. Oh, you know what I should do? Oh, I know what I should do. Screw that. Let's make a better HV. I mean, I'm way higher level for that now. What am I at, too? Level 19, 137 kills, zero deaths. Oh, yeah. I should have showed this earlier, but here, let's show it where it's easier to see. There we go. Uh, okay, so I got my work cut out for me. I'm going to multi-tool down my HV. I'm going to spawn in a better one with drills and turrets. Uh, and then I'm going to go hunt some golems and uh, pick spice and get my garden going, get that filled in, uh, upgrade my, um, upgrade a uh, constructor, get that filled in, get, once I get the constructor done, I can build the rest of the grow plots and upgrade my, uh, my T2 multi-tool, then I can go multi-tool the rest of the the Titans and finish building this thing. So, whew, got a lot to do still. Still got a lot to do. But I think for this video, we're done. So, until next episode, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day. <laughs>